how to fix WordPress broken themes issue. If you're seeing error messages such as template is missing, standalone themes needs to have index.php template file, or child theme needs to have a template header in style.css style sheet. Now these are broken themes, but if you visit your website and if you can access it and there is nothing broken there, then realize that's just the way WordPress works to show these errors. So let's go and fix these. First, let's look at this child themes need to have template header in style.css. What does this mean? Let's log into our web hosting manager, press on file manager, go and locate our themes folder. It's usually under public underscore HTML WP hyphen content folder and in there we have themes folder and here is where your themes reside in. I'm using a child theme, let's go into that, let's right click and add it style.css. Now the reason WordPress complains saying template header in CSS file is missing is that if you're using CSS minifier plugins and so on for your WordPress site, then that actually will automatically remove the required header section of a style.css. Now, this is all gibberish code, so if you're looking at this thinking, what's going on? Don't worry, because what I will do is actually show you what that is locally. So we're looking at the same CSS file. So this and my local copy is the same. Now, let's look at raw. Okay. This is what is missing. That's what WordPress is complaining about. Now, the fact is, you actually don't need to have this to access your website. But to fix the issue, let's go and edit this file here. So let's edit it. And let's just copy something like this. So keep that in mind. I'll make this code available in the video description. Okay? All you need to do is change it to match your theme details. So let me go to the front a couple of spaces and let me paste that code and now let me actually save this file now if I refresh this that style.css error should be gone now as you can see that CSS warning is gone now right but I still haven't fixed that index.php bezel so let me delete all these changes that I've made so I can show you the error code again. So now both errors should come up because I want to show you how to fix this index.php error message now. So we're still in our themes folder. And in here, WordPress is looking for a file called index.php. So let's create that file and call it index.php. Let's create a new file. Let's blank file. You can actually leave this as it is right now. Or you can add it and say to make things perhaps easier for yourself. Because this is the way WordPress actually So it's just a PHP block here and we've got a comment. So if I show you this in color coded format, you'll see what that looks like. So it's just a PHP code with a comment. No one's gonna see that, right? Let's save changes and let's refresh. And let's go back to our themes folder 
And in here we have a file now called index.php. Now let's refresh this page. And now that error should not be there anymore. So this is how you fix WordPress broken themes. Index file is missing. Style sheet header template is missing. Once again, you can actually ignore these if you want. Because as long as you're seeing your website, and you can actually go to Google Search Console and fetch as Google to see how Google is seeing your site as well, to triple check everything if you want. But now you actually have the knowledge to get rid of these error warnings that WordPress throws because of the way it works. Once again, thank you very much for learning with Rankia. If you benefited from this video session, please do give it a like and share it. And I'll talk with you in the next video session.